guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark Survival Plus. Ah, oh, my head. <laughs> I thought I'd jump higher. Damn. <laughs> uh, anyway, we're back and um, today we're going to be doing a lot of building. And that's specifically over in our back garden over here because we don't really have much of a back garden going. Oh wait, no, we do. I was doing a little bit of work between episodes and I've done all of this like paving up here and I still need to fix a couple of pieces here like I gotta get another piece on this level to come across to here. It's kind of a bit of a bit of a task because this stuff is not very easy to work with. I mean like it's pretty good but sometimes it kind of just gets a little bit messy like this so I gotta fix that at some point but I think we can still try to get some of this done here today. So I've done a little bit of building in the background and a lot of gathering and stuff. And so far we have our stable here, which we're going to be putting up on the very back there. And I've got some stable doors here as well. Can I carry all these? I better put these in here. So let's go ahead and just chuck this thing down. Oh my god, it's big. <laughs> we already have one of these actually. It's right over there. And that's like kind of like a community one. But I want my own one because like I have uh, quite a few creatures here as you can see. I've got my dire wolf that we got last episode. We've got a couple parasaurs. we got two horses. We're probably going to have more horses eventually and more parasaurs and stuff, but for now, this will do, so let's, uh, let's see about chucking this thing up here, okay, alright, let me see, kind of wanted to get mostly over this side, is that okay over there, I know it's not straight or anything, I just kind of want to line it up almost with the peak of like that bit over there to the very right, if you can see that, uh, let's try and just get it straight here as well, by the way guys, if at any point in this video you find yourself liking this video, be sure to beat the crap out of that like button. Survival Plus, one of my favorite my favorite series to do right now. Having a blast with this series. Honestly, every single day I just want to come on and do more, but I can't always play every day because I have to do other series and other bits and bobs and <laughs> I really just want to play. I re I just keep wanting to play. Uh I think that's probably good. It looks like it's okay. Let's go with it. We can pick it up if it's wrong. Alright, let's see. Oh, this is weird. What the hell? Um, hmm. That's odd. Oh, now I see what's happened. We didn't do anything wrong here. It's actually just the way this thing snaps down. Look at that. It's like naturally crooked. Huh. Maybe eventually when they fix that, I can replace this. Let me have a look at this one over here really quick because this one might also be like that. Uh, let's see. No, this one's not like that. Maybe it's just the terrain that I have mine built on? I don't know, actually. Like, that's kind of weird. I, I don't understand why that happened. Huh. Well, you know what? It's It will do for now. I mean, this it's not too bad. <laughs> it kind of looks a little bit weird, but it's, it's not the worst thing in the world. And I guess even if we wanted to, we could actually go ahead and just remove these paving slabs. Would that look terrible? Probably not, actually. Let's go ahead and remove this. What just broke? Oh, these bits over here. Crap. You know what? It will be okay. We can remove these. Everything will be fine. We're not going to break anything, hopefully. Uh, more bits over there are breaking. <laughs> I thought it was the stable the first time there. And that really worried me. Because breaking the stable would be a bit of a pain. Because this thing was not cheap. Costs quite a bit of resources. Alright. I think that's... Oh god, it happened in here too. Damn, what is this? <laughs> it's like slanted or something. Kind of weird, but it's okay. It's not too much of a pain. We can always go ahead and replace this if we need to at some point. But I think we solved it. Anyway, look at that. It's amazing. It's fixed and it's raining. <laughs> Alright, so I gotta come along here and get some of these paving slabs up along the same height as this one and that one. I'll do that in the background because it's probably not gonna be the easiest thing to do. As you can see, it's not even placing well, so we might not actually be even able to do that. Possibly. We'll see. Anyway, I'll do that at some point. The main thing today is working on the stable and working on the back garden. I want to build a couple other things back here, like um, they have other things like uh, gazebos and like an outhouse and like a shed and different things like that. We're basically just kind of setting up our back garden here with a couple things that we'll need and like places to store things, places to put dinos and other stuff like that. So the, these are the stable doors here. So as you can see, they kind of like open up like that. Let's go ahead and just chuck one of our horses over here. 
have a look at this. Also, you know what? Actually, a little well over at my place would not... That would actually kind of look cool. Yeah, like a little well somewhere. Unfortunately, this whole freaking stable thing has taken up a lot of room, though. Uh, especially with the staircase I had to build up to it, so... I don't know. We might not have the room. So we got our horse in there. We can go ahead and chuck another horse into there. Uh, from what I remember, the parasaurs are quite big, so they can't really... I, I, they can fit into a stable. Like, you can fit two of them into one of the... Whoa. Two of them into one of those things, but, um... I don't know. I, from what I remember, they were kind of, like, glitchy on each other. So, yeah. Because parasaurs have, like, a large hitbox, even though they're not that big. Yeah, so that looks good. Let's go ahead and just close these up. Ooh. Nice. Okay, I guess we can put the direwolf over now as well. Hey, buddy. Come on. Over here. Did I even get you on follow? Yeah, I did. <laughs> Alright, are you coming? No? Alright. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> are he stuck? Oh, he's stuck in the stupid parasaur. They have a stupid hitbox. Alright, come on. Let's bring you over here. I'll put you into the last one in case you go feral and kill my horses. I can't get up on this side. Wow, I have to do some more work here. Oh my god. Can the... Yeah, you can get up. Alright, sweet. I'll leave you in here for now. Ooh, oh, I'm stuck inside the door. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> Alright. So, I guess we can just put these parasaurs in here too. See how this is gonna work. Um, I'll definitely stick one of them in here. Right, let's get that one open too. I'll stick you, like, right here, maybe. It's kind of awkward. I want to, like, angle him in so then I can kind of bring him to the front and then... No, that didn't really work very well. we got to walk him backwards in, I'd say. Just to kind of get him to, like, the very side. And get him kind of towards the front. That's fine. Screw it. I'll just leave it. Alright, let's get the other one in. Um, I'll put you in there as well. Man, that stable looks really cool, though. I gotta say that, like, there's so many awesome-looking buildings. Look at that. Look, I can't get in here because of the parasaur. It's not the door, by the way. It's actually the parasaur. See, like, once he moved his head, I could get in. Alright, I'm in. Yeah. Okay. So, one more. We'll stick him into the last one over here. You got some levels as well. Let me see. Oh, you got two levels. Sweet. Uh, stupid level up animation. Stop. No. Crap. Alright. Sweet. We're out of that. And it stopped raining. Amazing. Alright. So let's chuck this guy in here. Can we open up the door? Damn. I got one of them open. I couldn't open up the other one. Ooh. Quick poo. And we're in. Come on. Line up properly. Alright. That will do for now. Sweet. Let's close this up. And that is our stable. Pretty amazing looking, I gotta say. Definitely goes well with the house. Alright, so let's go ahead and build some more things here. And I wanted to take you guys through a little bit of this. Um, how did they not go in there? Were you just... Okay, there we go. <laughs> they did, but they just didn't at the same time. Uh, server save or something, maybe. I'm not sure. Alright, so we gotta go ahead and get ourselves... I, where are they? Gazebo. Gazebo, where are you? What is that? Oh yeah, the outhouse as well. That's We also got to build one of those too. Um, gazebo, where is the gazebo? It's going to build a shed. So I think I need a little bit more lumber and a bucket. Some more lumber and a bucket. What else do I need? Where's the gazebo? I can't see it. Where is it? Um, hmm. oh, there you are. Okay. All right. So we need a couple things for this. We need a wooden fence. We need a wooden stairs, um, a lot of lumber, and then some building materials, which is like something you can craft out of lumber. So I have a bunch of that stuff crafted up back here. Let's go ahead and just grab some of that. All right. Am I too heavy? Can I put some back? Oh, crap. You can't put it back? I thought you could. Alright, well, we can still move, I guess. <laughs> it's okay. It's not the end of the world. Come on, let me in. I want to move quicker. Alright, 
so we need to make up a wooden stairs and a wooden fence a couple wooden fences I think let's chuck all this in here but we need the building materials which is like the stacks of like what are they called again uh okay so gray white planks so if I just type in white gray white planks so we need three of those and we need stairs um, it's definitely this one I'd say. Oh, I need a mallet. Crap. Where's my mallet? In here? Yeah, there you are. Sweet. Ooh. Alright. So we need, what was it again? Uh, stairs? Let's get one. Oh, crap. <laughs> Let's get one of these crafted and what else was it again? Railing? No, it was like fence, I think. Wait, where do you craft those? Let me have a look at the gazebo. Wooden fence. Where do you craft those? In here? I think it is actually in here. Maybe. Maybe it's in here. Where do you craft the wooden fence? I think I have some somewhere. Let me have a look. I think I probably have some up here. I have no idea where to craft those. <laughs> I can't even remember. I have 10 of them right here, sweet. Okay. Let's go ahead, chuck these in here, and that is our gazebo. Alright, sweet. Uh, what else do we want to make? Outhouse? Uh, we need a bucket for that, so where do you craft the bucket in here? Oh wait, that's not how you spell bucket. Is this just a normal bucket? I need clay. Alright. Let's grab some of this and chuck you in there. Bucket. It's probably up here, right? Where's the other one? All right. So now outhouse. I should be able to craft this, I'd say. There we go. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> All right. So what else was it again? Shed. You can craft that too. I keep doing that. <laughs> All right. So. I think that's it. Let me have a look. Uh, rack. There was like a tool rack thing. I think I have some of these somewhere, but I don't know where, so I'm just gonna go ahead and make a couple of these. Oh, let's make some barrels as well. The storage ones, where are they? What is the difference between these? I don't know. Let's craft like four of those. All right, sweet. Right, so let's go ahead and just grab all this good stuff. We have our shed, we have our outhouse. I already have some doors and stuff already made up. We have a gazebo, the tool rack, and then these things, and then the barrels, which should be up the top. Sweet, so we have all of that good stuff now, and I want to actually go ahead and just check out Neo's shop here, because I think he has something that I want. Um, there's like these hay bale things. Does he still have, wait, what are these? Tables, okay counters. Does he still have the hay bales? He needs to like fix up his shop. Everything's like everywhere. <laughs> Let's check this one. Come on. I know you have them somewhere. <laughs> I just don't know where. No. Alright, well I think I have one over here somewhere anyway. Do I? I know I put one of them somewhere. Let me have a look up here. There's like these round hay bale things that you can get. Um, I'll take those. Oh, there's the things. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> we probably could have went and checked. Actually, I think I might use this as well. And I have some walled barns. Alright, I think we're probably good. Let me take one of these, just in case. Um, yeah. Alright, that's good. Let's head down here and get some of this placed as well. So I just want to take you guys through some of the crafting in this, because I do a lot of the crafting off cam, because... It's quite like it's quite grindy and it like takes a while for some things as well. We'll probably move our feeding trough. Can we actually oh we can't pick it up. Sweet. We'll probably place that back here. So I'm thinking about maybe putting the shed over here. Um because I think it will look good. Let's have a look. Maybe we'll stick the shed like right along here, actually. And yeah. A little bit more. Uh, 
done a tiny smidge more. I know I probably could have just settled for it already, but perfection. That's that will do. That will do. Now let me just see about the back there, because I don't want the dirt sticking through it. All right, amazing! Look at the shed. We have a shed now. <laughs> We could stick some stuff in here. Let's have a look at those little tool rack things. Um, so we got one here. I need some barrels for in here as well. And a pot. Um, and that will do. So let me see. Oh, these can stick up. Amazing. That probably won't look good. Probably stick one up here. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Why? Can we actually stick stuff in there? Oh, we can. Interesting. Uh, oh. Is it like, is it gonna, no, why are you doing that? Like, <laughs> can you maybe like place on the wall? No? Okay. So we're, we're not gonna use one of those then, because reasons. I don't think this is the right barrel. Is it? There's like a different one you can make. These ones are cool too though, I guess. Okay, not bad, not bad. We'll stick one over here too. Okay, that will do. We'll leave it like that. And then maybe stick a clay pot on the top of one of these. And that's what I really like about this mod. You can actually like place stuff like... It, technically, if I wanted to, I could place a barrel like halfway up this wall. Now, it would look terrible, but I could. And that's the good part. Like, you can place a clay pot on top of a storage barrel. Like, how good is that? It's just, it's awesome. <laughs> Uh, I'll take some uh, doors here. Let's go ahead and put one of these onto the shed. Nice. That looks good. Oh, crap. Yeah. We'll move this one here. We'll move that barrel. Uh, we'll stick him maybe like right here, actually. I think that would look kind of good. Uh, let's put that right here. Leave like a gap in the center or something so it's not very... I don't know, like, I don't know. <laughs> I think it looks good. I like it. Let's close that guy up. So we have our shed now. Uh, let me see about this outhouse. I've never actually, I think I've seen this. There's one of these in the trailer and they had like a guy sitting on it or something. So, oh wow, that's pretty big actually. I feel like it would should be kind of close to the house. You know, because, like, in case you need to go during the nighttime, you don't want to have to run all the way down to the end of the garden through, like, wet mud or something like that, so... I don't know. I, technically, we could stick it here, though. I mean, it's probably something we can pick back up, so I guess I could just place it. Yeah, we'll just place it. Like, right there. Who doesn't want to go to do their business beside a, uh, a large wolf and some giant dinosaur things? <laughs> so there's our outhouse. Oh, it has like little little things here to let out all the uh, the smell. Can we sit on... Oh, we can! Oh, amazing! Look at this! <laughs> I'm pooping! Wait, can I poop? Oh, it rolled down the back! Oh, that's not... that's not... okay. Why, why did it go down the back? I don't like that. It's This place is going to soon get very messy. <laughs> so we have our little outhouse now. That actually looks kind of okay. I don't mind it back here. I think it actually looks kind of good. Technically, we could have stuck it beside the house, but I think this is looking good. And you know what? We need our privacy. So you got to put a door onto one of these as well. Yeah, so we got we to gotta close the door once we get in, have a little sit down. You know, maybe we could put some magazines or something here, you know, some reading material. I might have a look at maybe getting some books made or something like that. <laughs> oh, that's kind of funny. I like that. All right, so what else do we have? We have the gazebo, which I've never seen. Hopefully, we can pick this thing back up. Oh, whoa, that's big. Okay, let me have a look. This is, like, quite big. I don't think this is going to go into our back garden. <laughs> I mean, I could stick it, like, right here. It's not the worst thing in the world. I guess. Um. See, I don't want to intrude too much in Tag's place over there. Hopefully we can pick this back up, because if we can't, I'm going to be kind of annoyed, because it's very expensive to make. Those lumber pieces are not cheap. 
Um, let me see. Maybe if we we could probably place it like right up the center, as kind of like almost like a walkway through. I know it's crooked right now. We'll definitely try to straighten it up. We can judge off of the path right there. It looks like it's kind of okay. A little bit more. Looks good. All right, we just bring it forward a little bit more. This might work. This might work. Um. Hmm. You know what? Like, it's not the worst thing. I don't know if it. Hmm, I don't know if it's like too much though. I don't know if that's like too much. Let me see what it looks like when I run through here. I mean, it looks cool the way like we run through here and we can get right down to the stables. That's cool, but like... I don't know if it suits. Like if I could get it right up against the house almost. Maybe. I don't know. Hmm. You know what? Maybe for now. Oh, you're kidding me. We have to demolish it? Are you... That is so stupid. Give me a pickup option. <laughs> now I kind of want to keep it here. All right. Well, you know what? We'll leave that here for now. Let me know what you guys think about that. I'm going to have to demolish it if I need to move it. So, like, I'll leave it there for now just so I don't make any drastic changes that I'm gonna regret <laughs> but uh I don't know like it's kind of okay I don't know <laughs> let me know what you guys think about the gazebo definitely need some feedback on that guy right there uh do we we have something else that we can place right open barn this is kind of like the gazebo except it's a barn uh we could place this Maybe like right along here, maybe? Let me have a look. It's okay that this one's sticking into the ground. It doesn't have a floor. All right, that's completely crooked. It's a little better. It's a little better, a little better. I like it. All right, let's just place it down. We I think we can pick this guy up. Doesn't look bad, I guess. And we could stick some stuff in here. Can we stick the barn doors on that thing? Um, let's have a look. No. This is kind of somewhere where you'd kind of just like put things, I guess. We can pick it up. I don't know. This might be too much, like all of this stuff. We have quite a lot going on back here. So I think for now we'll, we'll get rid of the open barn. I know if I ever need more storage for like dinos or anything like that, I can always just place another barn somewhere. And uh, yeah, maybe Tag and I could work out some sort of like big barn system back here. Because I'm not sure what he's doing with the back of his house here. So yeah, I don't know. But uh, yeah, I'm really, I'm liking the, I'm liking this thing here, the stables. And I like the fact that all of my, I don't like the fact that I have to jump over here. I do like that I can store all of my uh, all of my creatures in here, and they're pretty safe. The main problem with this is that, like, well, with parasaurs, is that they will actually run if something attacks. So if like anything comes over and starts attacking, they will just start running. But now that they're inside of the barn, that means that they can't run. They can't get out of there. So, like, I know I have a parasaur that's actually like on the way out to the water. There, he's like, there's like a cliff over there, and he's like, he's just chilling over there because. Something attacked and he ran across the water. And the other day I saw that like somebody's somebody's parasaur was killed by a megalodon, and that's because something attacked and it ran all the way over there. And it's just it's silly, it really is. So now we have our our little stable, and <laughs> that's hilarious looking. We have our stable, and we can eventually uh, stick some more stuff in here. And actually, the next tame I want to try and get pretty soon here is a iguanodon. You know, because, like, I want those big derpy glasses like Neo has. 
Uh, I like that. And they're pretty fast as well, so it's a pretty good mount to actually have. And they can jump as well. Ooh, no. I thought I was going to get stuck. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Um, so yeah, actually, let's just do a little bit of a walkthrough of, like, the village here. Because I've done some changes. I'm just going to gamma up really quick. So let's actually go on, um, Neo's Iguanodon, just for fun. So all the way over here, um, we just start all the way at the end. So we're going to try and start placing some stuff down here, start building a couple things along here, getting some, like, docks as well. But, um... I think down this end we're gonna try and place some like farm type stuff and gonna we're gonna eventually get rid of all these like thatch houses and stuff like that um so yeah some like farms like more stables a couple like there's fiomia pens there's like more different farming pieces but um and maybe a couple more windmills once they fix that bug where it makes our games crash so yeah we're gonna place a couple of those down there and docks all the way up along here like a big dock station probably i'd say like right here maybe and we're gonna probably move that lumber yard somewhere else. Um, and then, like, just more shops. I think once we get to this point here, this is gonna be, like, the shopping district here. Once we get to, like, this line. So there's gonna be quite a few shops along here. Uh, we're gonna get a couple more utility things back here. Actually, there's something else that we can build today, which I might actually go ahead and do, because we got some time. Um, so, yeah, we've got quite a few shops along here, but, like, there's, there's space for more. There's space right here for another one. Um, and then, oh, actually, a project coming up pretty soon, guys. We're gonna team up with, I think, probably Jim, and we're gonna get a jail house built back here, and we're gonna have a jail on the server, and if people were, you know, if people were acting the maggot, they get put in the jail, because that's how it works. <laughs> well, we'll, I don't know, we might do some sort of, like, funny little skits or something to do with that, maybe. Um, and then, back over here, I just went ahead and put a bunch of docks around, tags, um little what is it called the in tags in so maybe you can build like a restaurant out there or something oh wow game what's happening oh you're okay yeah you're okay <laughs> so uh then over here ooh, mind the windmill of death we're gonna have probably maybe like a ship captain shop or something neo said he might want to build something like that eventually so i left a little bit of space over here for that uh we got a parasaur in the water that's okay <laughs> And then up here we have a couple houses being built. So we've got my one, then we've got tags, and then we got Neos. And then beside Neos we have Shredders, and I believe this is Axeman's one that he's still working on. And then Jim's building one here as well. And then we're gonna extend down this path and a couple more people are probably gonna build their houses too, like Evo and and everybody else. Um so yeah, that's all like coming up pretty soon, guys, because we've got some pretty exciting plans for the server. And let me just see if we can quickly... I'll just chick, I'll chuck this thing back first. <laughs> it's not mine. Uh, yeah, I'll chuck you back there. Let me just see if I can go ahead and actually make this thing. Uh, where are you? Um, I don't think it's in that. I think it's in here. Let me see. Um, where would it be? I think this is it. Yeah, that's it there. So I need wood support beams... Buckets of lime mortar and shingles. I have a bunch of shingles at the back. We just go grab all that. We got a little bit more time to get this done. This is a like an egg incubation shack thingy. So once the eggs get fixed on the server, we can start incubating a bunch of eggs over there. And uh, it should be pretty cool. But unfortunately, I can't really test it out today. So let me see what else we need. We need wood support beams and lime mortar. I think I have some lime mortar in here. Lime mortar, we need 15 of those, right? Uh, and then wood support beams. Do I have some in here? Uh, support beams. Yeah, there we go. Amazing, we have everything. <laughs> All right. So, lime mortar, support beams, egg shack. There we go. Nice. All right. Um, anything else that we can build? Probably not. All right. Let me see. Incubation shack. All right, let's have a look at this then. Okay, ooh, that looks cool. <laughs> All right, let's go over here and place it. So probably, I'd say behind Shredder's shop here. Maybe. I guess we could also place it over here. If we could get it to be straight. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, maybe over here. I uh, don't really want to intrude too much on Shredder's shop. Like, I'll tell him, I'll let him know if he needs to move this thing. He can totally move it. 
There's no problem about that. Uh, let's go ahead and place this guy. Let's place it out a little bit. Just want to get it kind of lined up. And place it out just a smidge. There we go. Oh, that looks awesome. Look at all the eggs in here. What is that? A diplo? That looks like a raptor. Anything up there? No. That looks like a micro raptor or else a, a giga or a bronto. No, it's definitely not a bronto. I think it's a micro raptor or else a giga. This is a packy one. I think that's another packy one. That looks like an, a packy rhinosaur. Maybe an aloe, possibly. I don't know, but that looks really cool. I like that. Holy crap. All right, we got to go get some waters. <laughs> All right. Anyway, guys, that is probably going to be it for today. We've done a lot of building. We've done a lot of cool little things around the area here. Now we have our amazing looking egg shack, and this looks really good along here, actually. I, I quite like this. We're going to have our jailhouse as well. Oh, man. Such a cool setup for the server, and I'm really happy with the way that things are going here. Really enjoying this so much, <laughs> but I'm still not sure about this thing. Let me know, guys. Do you let me know about that. <laughs> so, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to beat the crap out of that like button. If you guys want to see more like this, you know what to do. You gotta subscribe. And, uh, yeah. I will see you guys next time.